Kirby fans and welcome back to the channel. Hope you guys enjoyed my last episode. For those of you new to the channel, make sure you check those out. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and ding that bell for notifications of upcoming videos. Welcome back. So today, what we're going to be doing is setting up our Kirby as a portable compressor. Um, so what I'm going to be doing is showing you how to convert it to the blow side. Um, so it blows, literally. Um, and uh, yeah, we'll get to it and show you things that you can actually do with it. So, at the moment we've got our Kirby set up in the upright position um, with the bag on and the belt still attached. Um, I've just finished the video which I was doing with the mattress. So yeah, I reassembled it and decided to make this one. So what we're going to do is we're going to convert it to a compressor, to the blow side. Now you can use it for your portable shampoo as well. Um, so if you're, vacuum, if you're shampooing, then you convert it this way for shampooing your car interior or any um, settees or suites, simple like that, or curtains, exactly the same way. But today we're just going to be focusing on the blow and the compressor side. So first up, what we're going to do is remove the bag. Again, so if you watched the last video, there's a little button at the back here. You push that in, unclip it, and away you go. A bit dusty. Okay, you can leave the handle on, it's entirely up to you. I like to convert it down to a, a smaller one, but at the moment we'll just leave it with the handle on. So again, move our, head, our light up, wind our belt off, switch across, and take the head off. Or All right, next up, you're going to put your intake valve on, okay? So that just literally hooks on there. So with our hose, make sure this is facing out. Slot her on, and then you're going to, what I do is put my knee behind that side, stand this side, and just twist. And that's locked in now. So that now is in the blow position. So now we've got our vacuum, our Kirby, I say set up as a blower I've plugged it in so there's different attachments that you can get so obviously this is your inflator okay so this you can use for blowing out keyboards anything like that um, I better just mention obviously before I blow anything out with this what I do is I put aim the hose outside and turn it on just to blow any excess dust that was actually in the hose from, if it, from excess vacuuming that was used before because you do get a bit of dust either there or in the actual, just still in the machine. So make sure you blow that dust out because you obviously don't want to be blowing it out of over anything that you're blowing off or blowing into with this attachment. So this is the inflator. So what I'm going to do in this video is I'm going to demonstrate just one of the things you can blow up and it blows up really quick and you probably never think of this yourselves, but it's there. So just pretend you've got friends staying over and you haven't gone off room. So you decide to pull out the airbed. Now it's either one of those 12 volt compressors, you've got to go out to the car, plug it in, blow it with that, or you've got the best machine in the world to do it. Simple as that. So, roll her out, which you can use for camping. Okay, then you've got your attachment here. So if you wanted to blow it up with a little nozzle, you can, you can pull that bit out there, but I tend to get this, unscrew that, and put my Kirby over there. And you'll see, literally, how fast this thing blows up. It's literally amazing. It's gonna be loud, so if you've got headphones on, take them off. If you timed it, you could time it, rewind the video and just time it to see how long it takes. But it literally takes, I don't know, 30 seconds if that, I'm not too sure. 
Um, but that's a double bed. I mean, you can get the, you can do the big. We've got a massive one for camping. We've got the queen size, um, which we normally get if people are, are staying over and blow that up. And that doesn't take that long either. So again, another attachment that people don't think of. Now to take it down, obviously you want to undo that, but you don't want it to take forever and a day. So again, you can use your Kirby to deflate. So to set it up to deflate, it's literally a case of taking your hose off, taking your intake connector off, putting your bag back on. New machine. All right, and then we put our hose on this end. So what we're going to do is just unscrew our air bit, which is really tight. Obviously, most, some of the air will come out. Okay, because it's got an non-return valve on these anyway, so you have to take that out to deflate it. So then what we're going to do is put our, back, our Kirby there, and we'll suck all the air out. back in and that makes it 10 times easier to fold up so obviously it comes down a lot quicker than it goes up but that's again another thing you can actually do with the Kirby vacuum so I'm just going to quickly convert this back into the blow side again because there's another attachment I want to show you and I do use this quite regularly so put a hose on our intake on all right now what I'll do is I can normally convert it to a portable and I use it to go and blow the leaves out and the dust from around the house obviously we moved to Australia and we get a lot of a lot of debris around the house so it's quite handy for that because um, we haven't got a leaf blowout so we just blow it all away yeah, and then sweep it up and put it in the bin okay so the next main tool I use here um, for some reason I think the drains are smaller um, so when the uh, toilet gets blocked up we've got drains actually in the floor I kind of call it wet rooms um, so what I have to do I've, actually, I've, I've had to do it twice in this house in the past three years um, is I have to fill the bath fill the laundry sink send my partner down the other end of the house ready to flush the ensuite toilet and then what I have to do is get my son in, to stand in the shower with a wet towel over the actual drain and block that up with his feet and then I have to you get this attachment so this is your your um, duster brush Okay, just twist and off it comes. And then that you can literally put over the drain. You can either put it in the, down the bath, on the bath hole, or what we have to do, obviously we fill the bath full of water. So we put it on here. I, I get a towel, wet towel around it and hold it over the other floor drain in the bathroom. My missus flushes the toilet. It's a bit of a process. I, she shouts, I shout go. I let the bath go. I let the laundry sink go. I get my partner to flush the toilet, I flush the other toilet, the toilet's actually blocked, and then fire this on blow down that hole. Now, so far, touch wood, it's unblocked it three, uh, two times or three times, I can't remember, but it's a very good attachment, and it saved me on plumbers. So it's a really good attachment, and it's another use for your Kirby vacuum. So you've got to remember that, that when you invest in these, you invest in a home care system that's got that many uses, it's beyond belief. And yes, you may think it's expensive if you're buying it from the, the actual dealership, but over time, you're going to make that money back and save that money. And you're still going to have a vacuum in 25 years that's outdoing and outperforming every other vacuum. So I hope you enjoyed the video um, and it gave those of you a bit of knowledge that you hadn't got. Um, so yeah, those of you new to the channel again, please slap that subscribe button, ding that bell for notifications and um, make sure you share the page and for the subscribers I've got I've a real great thank you to you guys for my support um, it's really really appreciated and I, again I say I appreciate the comments you're putting on my videos and uh, again check me out on Twitter I'm gonna try and get the uh, gonna try and get the link um, put up today to my Twitter account so you can all follow me and yeah we can talk on Twitter as well so yeah hope you enjoy the video don't forget to subscribe guys and see you guys next time